Hello and welcome to our Oracle Enterprise Manager Cloud Control 12C demo series. This demonstration shows you how to monitor your database using the new Ash Analytics graphics that enhance what was called top activities in previous releases. OK, so from here, let's go to the target menus and select databases then select the database you want to uh, monitor and from there click Performance and Ash Analytics. With the new Ash Analytics page you can see two things essentially. The graphic at the top is a high level overview of your monitoring period. By default it shows the last hour but you can change this to the last day for example. There is also a time slider you can move along the timeline to zoom on that particular period which refreshes the second graphic on that page. Let's go back to the last hour and let's scroll the slider to this period. You can also extend the slider window to match better what you want to look at. The second graphic shows you the corresponding activity in terms of weight classes but you can change that. So for example let's look at the activity in terms of services here. When you pass your mouse over the graphic, you can highlight a service here and when you click, a filter is created to show you the activity in terms of weight classes, but for that particular service. Let's now look at the activity in terms of modules. Here again, you can pass your mouse over the graphic to highlight a particular module and create a filter for it. Finally, let's view the activity using actions. Scrolling down the page, you can see more details for your analyzed period. Here you have the details by SQL statements as well as user sessions. You can again customize this last part of the page. For example, let's view details about weight classes and then weight events. You can remove your filters if you want. Last part of the demo shows a different view of your activity called Load Map View. In Load Map View mode, you see boxes representing various tuning dimensions, weight classes and weight events. Here, user I.O. and corresponding weight events like DB file parallel reads. You can now change the representation to use up to three dimensions service, module, and SQL ID in the example. However, the graphics still use only the first two dimensions. You can look at the third one by moving the dimension slider. The advanced mode allows you to fully customize your viewed dimension on this graphic. Here we keep the first and second one and we select use a session for the third one. This is the end of the demonstration. Thanks for watching.